Seth Rogers, the biological father of missing 15-year-old Sebastian Rogers has come under fire after he admitted to being a suspect in his son's case. He said that police never cleared him, even after he passed a polygraph test, which was administered by Nancy Grace. It definitely didn't help when the new missing poster for Sebastian was released, and the remark section said Sebastian has ties to Clarksville, which is where Seth lives. Another interesting point to note is that it didn't say Sebastian was last seen at his home in Hendersonville, Tennessee, but rather in the area of Stafford Court in Hendersonville, Tennessee. A peaceful protest was held in efforts to get Seth cleared, so that they can get extra help. I believe the Cold Case Foundation cannot help unless the person has been cleared by law enforcement. Seth claimed that law enforcement wasn't communicating with him. He went on to say that he wishes local law enforcement were emotionally invested to do their job. But the $50,000 reward is great from the FBI. Seth also spoke at the rescue ride for Sebastian and had some interesting words for the sheriff. Take a listen. I wanted to tell everybody thank you. I appreciate everybody who showed up. You didn't have to. We're here for you. It's gonna be six months on Monday. And I'm just tired. I'm tired of the incompetence of the people who are supposed to protect our kids. They're supposed to protect us. They're supposed to keep our community safe. And they don't. And nobody holds them accountable or responsible. And it's the community that's supposed to be holding them responsible. Right now, they're holding an election for some douchebag that doesn't even understand that I am missing my son. I. I just want to thank everybody for showing up. Thank you. We're here for me, we're here for Sebastian. 